Soho with it. We about to be in Second Street. I don't know if I'm gonna put the GoPro on though. I might. This might be a non GoPro vid. We are gonna see though. We are gonna see what survives. Whether I'm gonna put that shit on or keep the phone out. They got Ricky on Ricky on Ricky. They got the Balenci. What the fuck are these, yo? They said three stripe heel. I ain't never been here. We in crossroads with it. These potential tees, the diesel, the thrasher, and found these Doc Martens, 55. I might pick these up. I might sneeze these. <laughs> That's off white, Brody, for 95. Yeah, let me get that too, matter of fact. The off white for 95. If it's not me getting it, somebody else gotta get it. That nigga said, yo. Damn, this diesel is tough. <coughs> Fuck, I ain't trying to spend it back crazy. We gonna see, though. We gonna, we gonna see what we pick up. We go Tim's on the feet. Yeah. Romero's on the feet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bottega's on the feet. Oh, my God. Yeah, that shit is fire. I mean, we in Buffalo Exchange right now. Fit check. Fit check, fit check. I gotta look for some tees. I already bought two tees. I bought the Doc Martens. I need more tees. What's that? Oh, that boy found vertebrae? Oh, this for the vlog. This for the oh vlog. God. Birdie, he's done for the day. Birdie. Hold on, hold on. This week, this nigga found Batman Reebok. He got them Bottega boots. Now he got the vertebrae. This nigga be hacking. Yo, what y'all know about the superstar Smiths, though? Like, what was Adidas thinking when they made this? I ain't gonna lie, bro. Adidas, y'all be cooking, but that shit burnt. The feet selection is... Oh, these, these not that bad. 11 and a half, though. Yo, bro. It's tough. Till it's not. Now it's an L. Like, come on, bro. I found Rick Owens, y'all. This is real life Rick. The hundreds. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. Every time I come to Buffalo Exchange, they kind of disappoint me. Like, they really don't be having nothing in here. If I find something, though, I'm going to show y'all. But so far, it is not looking good. They got the Prada Adidas. My size. But they want 200 I ain't going to lie. 200 for a pair in this condition is actually crazy. I might just cop this tee, though. This looks cool. We might just go this. That's actually in fucking insane. The Balenci's is hard though. We in Second Street again. See if we find anything in here because that Buffalo Exchange was fucking garbage. Louis. They got the bait bag. One thirty. Not gonna lie, that is not worth one thirty. Got a couple bait tees here too, but. They got them at like retail prices, so not really any good finds here. Mackage, that's whack. Ain't really shit in here. Back at the crib, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed that little, that little five minute segment, I guess. I don't even know how long that's going to be after I edit it. I'm so tired. I met up with the guys at like, like two o'clock. And it is currently like 8 o'clock right now. We were really in the city like all day. Just walking, taking the train, going to multiple different thrifts, crossroads, second street I haven't seen in a minute. I've been in Buffalo Exchange, but never those Buffalo Exchanges that I went to. 
and we were gonna hit up l train but the three of us just ended up being tired it was like a 20 minute fucking travel over there so that was a dub but we did get some good pickups either way and i'm about to show y'all right now all right hopefully y'all can hear me good we got the bag right here full of my stuff so in total i think i spent about like 90 dollars around that something like that we got three tees and a pair of shoes first tee i'm going to show y'all is actually the first pickup you got this shirt right here i don't know what it says uh i don't know the brand i think it's like a custom made shirt it just says bella canvas canvas this was 12 dollars you know nothing crazy just a simple shirt a shirt that could be worn a lot in the summertime this with like a pair of levi's and honestly probably the shoes that i bought today that would be a cool fit this summer i'm really just on my simple vibe i don't plan on going crazy with the fits i don't plan on doing too much graphic too much you know crazy pants and stuff like i just want to keep it simple collected and fly at the same time and i'm not really too focused on the fit picks or anything like that um i'm really just focused on youtube and making my videos and making thrifting videos for y'all um i think i don't know what that says it looked like it says theta or theta something like that nothing on the back just a simple low t fire second t we got this um i think that says isle of palms something like that south carolina yeah south carolina this is a fire tee just like the the fading on this tee the cracks on the letters i didn't try any of these tees on but i'm pretty sure that they're gonna fit um y'all are gonna see in the video i'm gonna put like i'm gonna put like a little segment of like me trying the stuff on they're probably gonna see me trying it on right now wearing it this was 19 dollars not gonna lie I really just went for shirts today. I didn't want to buy any pants. I did not want to buy any shorts. I did not want to buy any hoodies. I did not want to buy any jackets. I didn't even want to buy any shoes, but I seen these shoes for an amazing price and I bought them. Y'all gonna see them later. I was really focused on buying tees today and I didn't see too many good tees or like I would see like a tee that was nice, but it was just overpriced. And you know, like you don't have to buy everything, feel me? spend your money wisely $19 definitely gonna be worn a lot in the summertime nice little gray shirt we're not wearing black we wearing gray or white I sweat so easily so I need shirts that are gonna be very breathable to my body and not make me sweat because I be sweating like crazy all right so last T um Oh yeah, and both of those shirts were bought in um, 2nd Street. This shirt was bought at Crossroads. It's just a simple diesel tee. I don't know what this design is supposed to be. I don't know, like, I think that's supposed to be like a fucking bird on the top. And then this, I don't know what it's supposed to be, but it looked cool. I know diesel goes for like, they retail their stuff pretty expensive. This shirt was $25, which I guess it is kind of a lot for a shirt, but I mean, for a diesel shirt, for the amount that their stuff goes for, I think that's a pretty fair price. Size small, and it's very thin, so I could definitely wear this when it's hot out because it's very thin, it's kind of like baggy, and definitely gonna be a, a breathable shirt to wear this summer. $24 that's the three shirts that i got now for the shoes these i also bought at crossroads and i did not want to buy any shoes because i already have a lot of shoes and i'm done buying shoes i have sambas like let me show y'all right now let me take y'all off this thing these are all my shoes i got jordans i got dunks I got boots, I got Asics, I got Tims, I got Sambas, I got Converse, we got Tuffy. I have way too many shoes, but these 
were a pair that I've kind of wanted and I've kind of looked at for a little bit. I'm not super crazy about them, but for the price that they had them at, I was like, yeah, I'm definitely not going to find these again for this price. Like I got to, I got to buy them now. I might as well. And even if I don't wear them, I could definitely resell them on like Depop or something. The shoes that I'm talking about is these cherry loafers, Doc Martens. Y'all see the nice like burgundy-ish red color. These are super fire. This is definitely the vibe that I'm on this summer. Loafers, my Doc Martin, um, whatever these are called. These Doc Martens, those, these, and my Sambas, that's gonna be the rotation this summer, like to the point where they're all gonna be beat. $55 for a pair of cherry loafers. And the cool thing is with these is the more that you use them and the more that like you wear them and I guess like scuff them up and whatever, the red starts to like pop out. Here you can see the red is kind of like popping a little bit there. So yeah, that be happening in the toe, like it happens everywhere. I like this color, I don't want them to turn red, but you know, if they have little hints of red, I wouldn't really mind it, like it would be pretty cool. Definitely my favorite cop of today, $55, there's the proof. So yeah, that's gonna be the end of this video. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. I don't know how long this video is gonna be because the clips that I got are super short. I didn't record on the GoPro today, I should've, but I was just moving around so much, I didn't think about taking out the GoPro. Like the GoPro was kind of the last thing on my mind. I was just like, you know what? Let me get my phone, record, talk to the phone, way easier that way. So hopefully y'all enjoy the vid. Like, subscribe. Let me know your opinions in the comments, whether you think my pickups were a W or L. And yeah, subscribe. We out.